A very simple dish we're going to cook for you now. It's sea bass with spring onions and ginger, cooked in tin foil in the oven. A very simple dish, a very classical dish. It's with sesame oil, soy sauce and some fresh coriander. So, we take our tin foil, we take a little toasted sesame oil, just a splash. And we take some spring onions, just cut them in half, take our fish. Approx one third of the way down. A tiny bit of wine. Just fold it over very carefully. So it's sealed inside the bag. So there's our sea bass now ready to cook. When I was asked many years ago to create menus for P&O Cruises, I had to think of where do I take my inspiration from? And the one thing that dictates is the sun. I felt that sunshine flavours were really important. So when you're in the Mediterranean or in the Caribbean, food works. So here's our sea bass in the bag, ready to cook. We place on the stove to get some heat into the bag. You can do salmon steaks this way, very simply. If you want to do a whole sea bream, again, very simply. And once the white wine starts to bubble, into the oven it goes. A kilo fish is approximately 16 minutes at 200. Our sea bass is now cooking in the oven. So the first job we have to do, we cut our ginger into matchsticks. Some people like to peel their ginger. For this dish, it's not necessary. So we cut it into matchsticks. So there's our ginger in the pan with a little water. We take some spring onions, and again, just cut them quite fine, but at the same time, quite coarse. They don't have to be perfect. It's your choice how many spring onions you wish to use. Today, I'll mostly use about five or six for that size fish. All we have to do now is boil the ginger on the stove. The reason why we bring it to the boil is to take the heat out of the ginger so it becomes palatable. Now what we do is take that boiling water, we pour it over our spring onions. And let's not forget the water has been scented with the ginger. You still want them to have that bite, but at the same time you want them to be wilted. When people are cruising, food plays a very large part of their holiday. It's really important. What's key is the quality of the ingredients, especially fresh herbs, fresh fruit, fresh vegetables. Our sea bass has now been cooking for 16 minutes, so it should be perfectly cooked. Take some of the spring onions. You have to be generous with the spring onions and the ginger, really, because remember, you've got two sides of the fish, not one side. Take our sesame oil, splash it over, again, to your palate. Soy sauce. And take some fresh coriander. How to tell whether your fish is perfectly cooked? The bone should be pink and the flesh should release. A little bit of the juices, which is the natural fish juices with the sesame oil and the soy sauce. And there we have it. Sea bass cooked whole in a tin foil bag with sesame oil soy sauce, spring onions, ginger and fresh coriander. Dinner within 30 minutes.